Hello and welcome once again to Red Gaming Tech and welcome back to Cube Worlds. You guys may remember that I had a look at this game as sort of a first impressions review type thing quite some time ago now actually. Uh, it must have been at least a month ago if not longer and I really liked it. I gave the alpha of the game a big thumbs up, a lot of potential and you guys definitely check it out but I decided, you know what, I want to continue playing it as a series. Now I've leveled up my character by one level as you can see and I've got an ability as well as a little bit of armour uh, for my character. Not much, I didn't have quite enough to make uh, the armor that I wanted but as you can see I've gathered a little more so when we go back to town I might have enough I'm not 100% sure all I know is I didn't have enough for an iron chest plate when I originally went so you guys may remember this dungeon here was completely kicking my ass and my mission now is to at least get inside the dungeon or and conquer as much of it as possible I'm probably not quite strong enough yet but you know what screw it So let's try and separate them because I obviously can't take on both of them at once. So let's wait for this dude to come up here. And uh, use my ability. Oh, the other guys joined the party. Run, 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 run. Unfortunately, my ability is on cooldown, which is not really that helpful. Okay, it's not going particularly well, especially since the Beatles decided that, hey, you know what? I want to punch you in the face as well. Wow, this is not going well. I'm just going to leg it for now. I'll come back when there's not a beetle chasing me as well. There we are. <coughs> Oh dear. Oh no. Give me the stuff. I want it. Oh, At least I got the stuff before I died, hey? So that didn't go particularly well, but obviously I was being molested by a beetle as well, so that wasn't really what I'd call fair. But hopefully that guy hasn't respawned. Um, where are the ruins at? Apparently they're right here. So let's just go this way, I suppose. So that went eh, okay. A oh, great axe, huh? Power. HP is more though. So let's replace my weapon. That's for a mage. Mm. There's an amulet that I can't use because I'm not level. I don't have enough power. I don't know what my current power is actually. Not really sure. Power is five at the moment, so definitely not enough for that. Yeah. This away, I suppose. Okay. Round two. Fight. So let's see. Has he respawned? That mage? That undead? Nope, cool, excellent. You're mine. Oh, of course there's more. Of course there's more. Of course there's more. That would just be, uh, you know, too little of a challenge, right? Damn it! There you go, bitches. I'll at least take one of you down with me. Well, I went down swinging. <laughs> I've got a feel. Oh god! Ow! I've got a feeling this is going to be a bit of a pattern. Maybe. Uh, I'll tell you what. I'll give it one more try, and then if not, I head back to town. Uh, as you can probably tell by my map as well, I did do a bit of exploring and there's, there was quite a few orbs and things around here that I couldn't actually get because there was it was night time and I was getting ravaged by some giant monster. I, don't, I have no idea what it was. Cute. It's probably heal as well. Okay. Right. 
see if, if I got anything else useful. So, um, I could go for two of those. Two damage fours, HP 7.5. Hmm. Hmm. Screw it, let's try it. Go for dual... Go for dual swords, why the hell not? Why the hell not? That's what I say. That almost was Star Wars music, but not quite. <laughs> yeah, where was that entrance? It was over here. Yes. Right, so don't actually go inside the dungeon is the key, I think. Sort of lure the guard out. Hello. Come and play. Come on. Come and get me. Hmm? Don't you want to play? <laughs> Oh, that move is pretty OP. Oh yeah! Right, let's quickly heal. Alright, uh, I think it was F, yeah. Oh, hi friend! Ooh, bitch. See how you like it. Hmm. Let's quickly head back outside before I get ambushed or something. I think I'm going to change back, actually. Because, I don't know. I prefer a speed character over sort of a slow, tanky character, but their swords just don't have the damage, especially when I'm under-leveled. Right, so let's just head back in. There's loads of guys over there, do not go that direction. Our examine. There is nothing special. Okay. Can I do anything with you? Nope. Oh, there's... Oh, God! Quick! Oh, God, this is not going well. Quick! Run! Oh, it's going better than I thought it <laughs> This is clearly not how you're supposed to do a dungeon, but my only real criticism of this game so far is that it takes forever to level up. <laughs> oh god, that was wind magic or something there? Oof, okay. Let's uh, have a, mum a muffin. I'm gonna check my inventory for any goodies. It's quite a little cheeky way to level up actually. You sort of run into a dungeon, take him out one by one and then just pew 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 your way to victory. Can't. There we go. Stop. Let's see. Mage. I've got an iron sword. Silk boots. Uh, nothing else I can actually use, which is a bit of a shame. Wieldy wooden staff. What if you can trade items between characters? Because I'd actually make a mage just to try it out. Uh, still level one though. Okay. Um. Let's see if I can. Woo! <laughs> 
I don't know what that noise is. Oh god, 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 oh god. Run for your life quickly. Whew. I'm not gonna be able to heal all the way, obviously, but still. Just quickly kill him, hopefully, before he kills me. There we go. Oh, the sky. Oh, he was he was fast. Damn. Let's see. Mountains. I can hear someone's attacking. Oh, they're down there. I would get involved, but I'll probably get killed. So, not not a hero day today, I think. And I'm really loving this game so far. I definitely want to play more of it, especially as it progresses into the later stages of development. Don't ask me why I'm humming that. I'm not really sure why. It just seems appropriate somehow. Oh, might need my lantern on. It's a bit dark. Ooh, let's so treasure. Okay, stay over this side so they don't notice me. Pew pew pew! Or bash bash bash! Oh dear! That is not good. Oh dear, this is not... No, definitely not ready for this dungeon. Definitely not. How the hell am I still alive? I don't think this is what they meant by fast food. Just say. Like <laughs> I think I'm poisoned or something because I'm green. <laughs> oh no, this new. No. Oh, okay, so what? Oh, did I just get chest armor? Oh, oh, no, 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 don't fall. Oh, sweet, I can use it. Uh, anything else? I've got a, ra a bracelet that I can't use, gloves I can't use. Yeah. Nothing I can actually use, which is a little bit of annoying. A little bit of annoying, a little bit annoying. Wow, I'm actually uh, somehow working. That asked me how. I'm running low on muffins. It's not something a hero says every day, but hey ho. There you have it. Such is the nature of Cube World. I don't know why I've got that in my head. I have not watched those films in years, which is a bit of a tragedy, really, considering they're classics. Right. Let's see if I can at least conquer this room. Go, go, go! Pew, 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 and all that. You're mine, son. I missed. Fail. I need my thing to recharge like now. Wait, what are you doing? Die quick now. Whew, that was uh, close. Whew. Okay, let's uh, use one of my life potions. And then, no! Shit, it's too late now. 
Actually, meant to switch over to something not as good, like a pineapple slice. Fail. Oh well. I actually conquered the first room somehow. Mm, can't. Actually, can I collect you or you? No. Okay, so the first room is somehow conquered. There's, whoa! <laughs> and this guy wants to say hello, apparently. Come here, bitch. Oh god, that wasn't wise. No, definitely wasn't wise. Okay, I'm getting out of here. Bye-bye. I had a good run. I had a good run. No! Almost got trapped. Oh, I had a good run. Let's see, what did I get? Mm, more wands that I can't use. Iron swords and iron axe. Shield. I got some armor finally, though, and damn, I'm not even close to leveling up again. Whew. Well, I think that's enough of me getting my ass kicked in the same dungeon over and over again. So let's head back to town. And excuse me, I'm so sorry. See if I can um, make something cool, and I'll show you the crafting system a little better because I couldn't actually find where you turn wood planks into blocks and stuff like that. It was a weird, bit of a weird place that was a bit hidden away in the town. And uh, we'll probably get chased by something way too powerful on the way there because that just tends to be how it goes. So all those supposedly low level creeps, they're actually going to kill you because they may be an insect but it's level, like level 20 or something. That tends to be how it goes. <laughs> Makes for an interesting introduction to the game, I can tell you that. So see, you said, oh, it's a sheep, it'll be really easy to call, right? No, not, not necessarily. Not necessarily. Yeah, let's try and keep on a straight-ish path to the city. Oh, someone's there. Uh, Oh, there's a tree there, actually. I can uh, pillage for resources quickly. Or a bush, should I say. Oh, I didn't get a log. Are you kidding? Fail. Do -do -do. Uh, they could be friendly or they could completely kill me. Uh, I think they're out of range anyway. It's fine. They're gonna... They're orange, so they're... Gonna be trouble if I get too close. So they're gonna see me if I try and make some stuff. Let's see. Uh, I can make food, but not much else here. But I've got some ginseng, so. Okay, let's go. They've spotted me. <laughs> Everything in Cuba is so aggressive. I honestly don't know what I've done to annoy everyone, but clearly it was something horrendous. What the balls is that? Lol, 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 lol. Enjoy that, bro. Did I just get experience for that? A cormling. What the balls is a cormling? That's what I want to know. I really want to see the, what the pets do, like, because I know you can get certain animals to be your pet if you feed them the right food, but I'm not sure what food you need to feed what animals to get them to follow you. It's a bit unclear. And apparently, I got six experience for that fight that I didn't even participate in. Maybe it's because one of the things was chasing me when it got kills, possibly. Yeah, I'm not going to complain. Free XP after all. Do do do. Do 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 do. Uh, 
It's been uh, an uneventful journey back to town, thankfully. Um, Travelling at night is not something you really want to do in this game, by the way, guys. Just a pro tip from me. I did that off screen a while ago and it wasn't particularly fun. Any oars? Nope, didn't think so. Worth checking though. Be surprised what you can find in random little crevices. Yeah, travelling at night you can barely see and if something big and nasty tries to kill you as it does tend to happen in this game, well, you're going to have a bad time. Let's just leave it at that. Can I pick these? No. Apparently not. Right. So, this should be the town. Yep. Let's see if I can show you guys the crafting place. Oh, and if you're wondering how you actually change it from night to day, you have to sleep at the inn. That's literally it. It's just random humming day today apparently. I don't know where all these tunes are coming from. I don't even know what half of them are. I think that's... Cr no, that's a trade. Let's see if I can find the crafting dr district. District? What's district? I'd love to know. Oh, you you okay there, friend? You, uh, yeah? You okay? You seem to be having a bit of trouble there, so just checking. It's on the outskirts of the town. Wait, is this? No, it's trade, trade. Keep going. Pet district? No. Where is me crafting? Yeah, crafty, crafty, crafty. I've lost it again. Here we go. Crafting district, right. Uh, let's see. Where is the actual centre part of this? There it is. And the other dude is here. This is where you can make your iron into useful things. So let's see. I don't have... Oh, I need a furnace for that, but I don't have any iron cubes, apparently. I've... Oh, those, those ones I've already made, I see. Uh, let's see, I can make a shield or a sword. That's it. A shield, uh, boots, power five. See, I've got some chest armor. The only thing different with this, it has one more crit ratio. Boots, I don't think I've got... Actually, I do. 7.3. Mm. Mm. No, screw it. That's, I didn't mean to make two, but there you go. Did not mean to make two. No, no, no. Where did they just go? Hello? Ah. I suppose I can sell them, but that was a bit of a waste of ore. And there's another guy here, if I wander over. He's got a saw where you can make stuff as well. Mostly to turn your wood into cubes. Uh, and there's also workbench. Let's see if I can make anything here. No. And there was a furnace over here as well, whereas if you've got some iron ore, you can, of course, use that. I don't think I have anything that I can actually... Nope. But... One thing I will show you is how to make health potions while I'm here. Sorry about that guys, for some reason my audio recording software decided that hey, do you know what would be fun? I'm not going to record, so I lost not much, but still. Kind of irritating. As I was saying about the water flasks, um, the one I've already got is actually already a water flask, but when you buy them from the shops, um, there'll just be a glass flask and then you need to craft it into a water flask in order to make 
a um, life potion. And obviously, basically, all you need to do is literally be in the water while you're doing it, and then that's it. And then once you've got some heart flowers, you can craft them into life potions. Obviously, you can pick them up in dungeons as well as the one I've got is. That's where I got it from. So, yeah. I can actually... I should be able to... Yeah, so you have to be by a campfire to, to make the actual life potion, but that's where you have to be for most of your basic crafting anyway, so that shouldn't be a surprise to anyone who is familiar with this game in any respect. So yeah, I think that's pretty much me for this first, well, the second episode, should I say, of Cube World. Uh, technically, my I guess my first impressions of you is my first part. It's my second part of the Let's Play. Um, what I'm probably going to do is level up to at least level 3 before my next part and then probably try and get a little bit further in the dungeon before I start recording and hopefully we'll be able to conquer it together. If not, well, it's just going to be basically explore, explore, explore because, well, as you can see, the most of the land I haven't touched on. I've... Even this is quite far, the Assar Mountains and the Chromie Lake, not really much there. But there's another dungeon there, not that I can even beat the one that's right there. And of course there's another one there as well, so yeah, lots of adventures to be had in Cube World for sure, 100%. Anyway, that is me done for this video, hope you've enjoyed my second part of Let's Play Cube World. Um, any tips, tricks, anything you want me to do in particular, do let me know course your guys opinions do matter if there's anything i can do to improve the series for you please do just leave me a message anyway that is me done for this video hope you've enjoyed it thank you very much for watching and i'll see you next time